Yeah. Yeah. There's another tunnel there. What? I have no idea where Baz has just gone. It's literally like he's just vanished. I was stood here at this point. I walked a little bit up there just to see what that track was, turned around. He's just gone, completely gone. Nobody in sight. Weird. Welcome back to the channel guys, thanks for joining us for another video on Team Explore in UK and uh, today we've come to Clifton Country Park uh, we've got some sculpture trails here and we've also got the ruins of the old colliery which was known as the Wet Earth so I'll attach some information on that now <coughs> Very sad that isn't it? Yeah. So I won't show you guys but there is just a uh, a dead uh, geese down here which we will report on the way out but yeah i will put that on camera nice beautiful views on the lake there. there's plenty of flies in my face yeah we're gonna head this way up this track which is to pass the fairy tale trail. See what we can find. Just have a quick nosy down here. There's a um, bit of a nice sculpture feature down here. Show where that leads to. There is a way through there. Is there? Yeah, there is. Uh, it's a beautiful lake, beautiful camping spot. There's quite a lot of campers out here, uh, fishing. Look like they're overnight fishing. Probably come across four or five different sets of uh, fishermen, campers. Um, so yeah, we've just approached the lake, come down from the main car park, and then we've headed to the left, which is just heading towards the sculpture trail, and see what we can find. We've just approached the river Irwell. On my left hand side we can just hear the waterfalls in the background so yeah hopefully we can cross that bridge and uh, get some better views and some nice pictures of that as we approach it but yeah very dark and dingy in here we do have all the paranormal equipment with us so yeah we'll see what happens just approaching uh, information board so we've made it up here to the top left hand corner and we came in from here so we've walked down here and across here to this point. We've got a nice big bridge here now. You start to hear that waterfall. Is it across here, bro? Yeah, across the bridge we've passed. We're gonna have a bridge I 
obviously a warning sign. Risk of serious injury, do not jump into a river. Doesn't look that deep at all. But yeah, very dangerous place to be swimming and jumping around. I'm actually quite excited to um, for that sun to disappear and just, just watch that darkness setting while we're walking around these woods. It'll uh, give off a real eerie vibe. This place is actually crazy. The pathway split up into about four small pathways and literally I've lost Baz already. I don't know which way he's gone. I don't know which way I've gone. And uh, yeah, I better find my way back to him and to um, a checkpoint of where I know I'm at before it uh, gets dark now. Pretty weird guys, there's literally nobody in sight anywhere. I can't hear and see anything or anyone apart from the wildlife. I have no idea where Baz has just gone. It's literally like he's just vanished. I was stood here at this point. I walked a little bit up there just to see what that track was, turned around, he's just gone, completely gone. Nobody in sight. Weird. Another little track down there leading off as well. Could have possibly took that one down there. What the? Where's he gone? That is so weird. He's literally vanished. See somewhere up there. If he's come down, he would have definitely gone up there. I almost got up, guys. I dropped my drink. <laughs> Deep. Whew. Where the heck has Baz gone? That is so weird. This little bunker we've got. Is that a torch on for this one? Yeah, starting to get a bit worried now, to be honest. It's um, it's completely vanished on me. A really old bunker. Yeah, Baz has vanished. There he is. He's there. We found him. Yeah, the maddest thing happened to me. Didn't it? Yeah, I turned around, you were gone, I lost you. Yeah. I'm running around on my video, where's Baz? Well, the mad thing is, I walked walk down there, yeah? Yeah. Like, trying to find that or trying to find something, yeah? Yeah. I crossed over and I was like, better find Lee on there, I said, because I think it'd be mad if, uh, you know, if it were dark, we were trying to find each yes. other. You're nowhere to be seen. It came through, hello, Leon. Yeah, and then I seen your torch, no what? bullshit. I fucking swear to God. No That's way. Bro, wait till you see my footage. Yeah. I'm panicking, like, where's Baz? <laughs> He's literally just vanished behind yeah, yeah. me. And I've literally just ran up a hill there, dropped my drink, had to run back down for it. What's this over here? And I literally said on my video, I said, you know, it'd be quite worrying. I need to find you before it goes dark. What's, uh, what's this here? Some sort of little bunker. Just about to start absolutely bouncing it down. You see them horrible clouds over us at the minute. So we're just going to head into the sculpture trail. At this end, this is where all the colliery ruins are. So yeah, lots of flies, lots of rain. So we'll see if we can get some cover for 10 minutes and let this pass. Managed to find some decent cover now and we've just come across our first, first ruins with some sort of big old cog here. I'll flip that round for you. A big old cog. Some sort of big old drive shaft. Whoa. 
weird. I'm gonna have a nosy inside here. There's no signs that say do not enter. Some big old pieces of steel. And some more brickwork. It's like some sort of chimney that. Yeah, it's all been filled in. Some nice big pieces of stone though. Not sure. This looks like it could have been the the walls could be formed for a wheel in here, water wheel. Yeah. Kind of looks like a decent size for it, doesn't it? You've got a huge cog there. A few big bits of steel. Look, yeah, it is. There, the um, thing is off the wheel. You know what? Scoop the water. You fans, propellers. <laughs> So yeah, that's the, um, that's definitely the water wheel. Down. So Baz has just noticed a tunnel under there. Yeah, we're going to see if, uh, see if we can get down to that. That could possibly be the tunnel that I was reading up on. That was um, once widened to allow the boats to go directly through it to which they could pick the coal up directly rather than it being moved to another pickup point which would have just been more faster and efficient at that time. So yeah, we'll see if um, see if we can get closer to that to have a nose in. Obviously there's another end of it as well which possibly might be just over here. So we've got another point there. There's like a huge well over there as well. Just not, it's just not, it's the big well up there. Where? Just literally there at the top of them steps. Yeah. Which the other side of this tunnel is going to be over there somewhere. Is that where the train used to go in there? Baz, we're going down there. Okay. I'll take it this is where they would have uh, attached a horse to allow that to walk around it and create some sort of motion. I'm guessing. Bit of an old, old hut there, that's... Probably an old tunnel where that's been blocked up. That blocked up shaft. Yeah. And this is what we want. What do you reckon that is down there? Part of that fucking thing, innit? That goes deep. It's a couple of um. That's death trap, don't get me wrong. Quite a few um levels of spiral steps going down. I'll show you these these guys are. She looks like an old witch. Maybe they're just old Victorian characters. Yeah that's pretty cool. A bit of something under here that's been fenced off. Yeah, that's definitely another tunnel that's been blocked up. Yeah, I'd love to go down there. Do we climb over? It's an easy climb to be fair. Where we go. 
So I'll be fucking breaking legs and shit, you got work tomorrow. Day. Day too yeah. One monkey boy. Thank you very much. Yeah. Oh, that nice, ain't you, Eric? There's someone waiting down there for me. Is it? You eat out? Yeah. There's another tunnel there. What? Another tunnel there. Tunnel? Yeah. Is that the entrance to that fucking thing, is Very slippy. Is that Solid door, solid steps. Here's a solid staircase, but obviously it's still very, very worrying. Just checking structure. This is not the place where you'd want it to cave in. You can see another tunnel entrance over there. All the steel's still in place. I'm just going to start to take my time now. It's quite slippy, but it's all right with handrails and it is checker plate as well, so. Just that tunnel opening over there, a couple of steels. And, um, no, but it's quite high up. It's quite high up. There's another one there as well. Yeah, there's a tunnel there and a tunnel there. You're, yeah, it's like a tunnel right underneath your feet. Wow, the staircase actually continues. It's just filled with water. Is it? Yeah. Can you not get to the tunnel from the water? No, you can't reach the tunnels anyway. Right from the water? They're just too high. So obviously the tunnel's bottom starts here, which is about three, four meters from water level. Some sort of shoot there. But yeah, there's the um, tunnel there. So we'll just go up and... What is that, mate? I'm not sure. I do feel like the staircase was put in afterwards. Maybe for maintenance or inspections or just history purposes. But there's the tunnel that's just been blocked up. You can see there's just loads of mud there. Very good structure on the tunnel very big as well it's got to be five six meters wide five meters high same level as the other one which you can just see there which potentially could have a 90 degree turn and go over to the other one that we've just seen <sighs> pretty scary that So yeah, there's the other tunnel, and there's the other tunnel there, so I'll just wait till Baz gets back and show them then. You can have a good see. If you just come round here, Baz, you might be able to see it with my torch on. Yeah. So there's the arch of the top of that tunnel. Right. It's probably about five metres high. Yeah. And there's the other one there. Let's see if we can get to the entrance of that tunnel. Over there. I yeah, reckon yeah. it links to that one, yeah, maybe. Yeah, probably, probably will do, yeah. Cheers, mate. Yeah. See if we can get in that front entrance. Definitely fucking thing on the fence. Definitely fucking. Oh, that's all, didn't it? They've even welded it on. Yeah. In fact, that's the only thing holding it on. A little tack of a weld. Would you? You wouldn't be getting in there, would you? I'd have a nose in just around the corner, even though I know it's blocked. Definitely railway line tackle that, innit? Right. 
These could have been the coal mines. What's that? These could have been the coal mines. Yeah, yeah, they would have bought it. Yeah, guys, I'm not sure what this is. And if it was um, some sort of haulage for materials to get them about, it's almost like boat shaped. Same on each corner, big heavy steel framework. Yeah, not sure. Let me know in the comments if you know what that is, guys, because I've never seen anything like that before. It's certainly not any kind of bridge access or steps, ladders, anything of that nature. But yeah, this is definitely the same tunnel that I've just seen inside when I entered down the spiral well, staircase. The tunnel, this will kind of do. Um, definitely Hogwarts stuff, but we end up. Some other bits of old buildings here or something. Some old walls. Just spotted that on our way. I was just gonna have a quick nosy up in and see if we can get to that and if it's got an opening. Wow. It's a big hole. Can't really see it on camera, but that is a huge, huge hole in the ground. Yeah, that's crazy. That's definitely some sort of old access point to the mines. As you can see, well, you can't really see, but the ground is just massively depreciated. To that for a huge depreciation in the ground. Yeah. That was definitely some sort of pit or access point. Yeah, they filled it in, didn't they, or whatever. Yeah. Some more fencing around some up there as well. That's all the fence off. Wow. So big in. Well built. Some nice feature stone work in it as well. But yeah, no entrance inside this one. Steps lead up here, don't they? Yeah. Big time. Just got back to the car park now, guys. That just about sums this one up for us tonight. Still a little bit light. Just about as to uh, go dark now, but it was dark enough in there. Yeah. Let me know what you think. Let me know what you thought about that video. Leave a comment, like, subscribe, all that good stuff. Thanks again for watching and we'll see you on the next one.